Hello again, everybody. Welcome back to SCV Castle. Uh, this is Stephen Vitz reporting. And um, this is going to be like a different video altogether. Um, I know I've said that a lot lately, but uh, that is part of the process, guys. When you're starting a, a YouTube channel and you're trying to, you know, work things out, you're trying to test things out to see uh, which kinds of videos are going to work out. And um, there's a trial period. There's always this trial period going where you post this kind of video and you see if that works. And then you go over here and post another uh, kind of video and you see if that works. Guys, just name one YouTube channel out there that doesn't do that. People are always testing out things. They're always testing out what works for them. So I believe that I'm no different when it comes to that. So the title of this video will be, You Will Find an Audience, Trial by Error. And that's exactly what it is. It's trial by error. There are times when you, you know, run something like this, a YouTube channel, where you're going to have setbacks, you're going to have errors, you're going to make mistakes. It's going to happen. There will be times where you will fail. Okay. I don't have any uh, expectations of, oh, I'm going to post this video and it's automatically going to work. No. That's not at all what I'm thinking. So I know that, like anybody else, I can be under scrutiny and uh, under attack. I can be given negative comments, which I already have on this channel. So what? And um, basically, when I go, when I go out of, what I want to uh, go through here is that you need to find what you like. It whatever you find, you know, enjoyable. Go ahead and post it on YouTube. Share it with people. That's part of the test. That's part of the trial. And um, you also need to try what you think is going to work. You may not know it, but you think it. So you have to try it. And if it doesn't work out, then hey, it doesn't work out. You try the next thing. You go one by one. If this doesn't work, go to the next thing. If that don't work, go to the next thing. Guys, don't be afraid to fail. Okay? When you're posting a uh, YouTube video, just look at me. Look at this channel. I've done plenty of trials already where some people, they probably don't like what they see. And other people, they probably do. And... And that's another thing I'm going to get to eventually. You have to block out the noise. You have to block out the negativity. And specifically about all the haters out there. I'm going to be addressing a video right to you guys eventually down the road. I'll save that for a good time. So, speaking of time, you guys need to understand that it takes time to, to get it right. You have to understand that it takes time to get the right uh, formula or blueprint going for something like a YouTube channel. It doesn't happen overnight. Name one channel that just got it right like that. You know, overnight is <clears throat> like someone posted a video about, you know, lawn mowing. And then all of a sudden it went viral. No. Realistically, it just doesn't happen that way. Unless there's something behind the scenes happening that's artificial. But, um, and speaking of artificial, I want to also point out, really don't force anything onto your viewers. Whatever audience that you're uh, trying to appeal to, don't force it onto them. You've got to be real. you got to be real with your audience and you got to be real with yourself. Guys, don't be someone you're not. Don't be something that 
doesn't represent you. You know, I know that many people are not going to like me for my uh, comments, for my uh, opinions, for what I believe in. But I can't let that face me. And I also can't change for people. I can't make changes just for the sake of making changes, okay? I can't be something that I'm not. And just because people post negative comments in the comment section below on YouTube, that's not going to change what I'm about, you know? I just won't. And also, whatever videos you guys do post on YouTube, really talk about what actually matters to you. Whatever the topic is that you're going to talk about, does that matter to you? Are you emotionally invested in that topic? Do you care enough to talk about that topic that you can make a video like this one uh, and post it for others to watch? I mean, really, that's it. If your heart is not into it, then why are you doing it? I mean, it's a fair question. And whatever you talk about, it's got to be relatable. You got you yourself, you have to relate to that topic. And you have to make sure that whatever you're talking about, other people that you're trying to uh, get your video out to, other people have to relate to that as well. If they can't uh, relate to what you're talking about, if they can't understand it, then guess what? You're not going to appeal to them. You're not going to get your message out there. So those are just some things I want to talk about uh, today. And I strongly encourage you guys in the comment section below to leave your comments and to share with me what you think about uh, finding your own audience on platforms like YouTube and other video uploading platforms for that matter. So um, I just wanted to make this a short video uh, today. I know that um, I haven't been uh, super active on uh, STV Castle lately, and that's not on purpose. It's just, it's just how it is. Real life gets in the way. And I know for a fact that I have many other topics to talk about and that is part of the trial and error process. You know, this is a video directed at everyone who is willing to support me and support uh, everything that I'm trying to do here. For you guys, uh, I'm hoping that you guys will stick by me and that you'll keep tuning in, you'll keep watching what I have to put out there. And once again, to my haters out there, to my enemies out there, uh, you guys just wait and see. I got something special planned there. But anyway, you're watching STB Castle, and there will be more content on the way soon. Thank you.